You know, I think we all know what's most valuable to us in what we need to do. I don't think we have any problem identifying those things that are important or most important uh, in regards to what we need to get done. And so the problem really is about competing priorities and it's not that we have a problem with priorities, it's just maybe a problem that there are too many of them or that they're just competing for the same amount of time that we want to get stuff done in. And again, it's not so much that we have these competing priorities, but it's that these priorities are now competing for us. And instead of us being in control of those things that we want to put on our calendar or on our to-do lists, those things are driving us to not take into account what ha what's happening in our daily lives. And so in essence, they are robbing us of opportunity to get a hold of our calendar. You know, it's often like we see those guys in the circus where they are running a whole bunch of plates on sticks. Or it's like these guys that we see in the circus who are juggling all these balls or juggling all these different things and you know we can understand that they can juggle three maybe four even five things but as they get up into higher numbers seven eight nine ten we're just marveling at how they can keep all these things up in the air but isn't that an interesting metaphor for us in our time management that we think we can just keep adding things on to our lists we can just keep adding things into our calendar and we begin to feel overwhelmed and we begin to feel almost overrun by the amount of things that we have to get done and it's just going to be a matter of time until something drops i think many of us oftentimes have thought maybe even said to ourselves i just don't have enough time i just don't have enough minutes or hours in the day to accomplish all the things that i want to accomplish it's like we can hear the clock ticking away and it's almost like a time bomb behind us and we're trying frantically to find out one how do we slow it down or two make it stop entirely but we know we can't do that we can't make time stop and yet we're trying to find ways to cram more stuff in I also think that it's when these competing priorities come into play, they squeeze out every last moment that we have and make us feel like we're just trapped. We're just, we're trapped in our inability to get stuff done. We're trapped in this hamster wheel of, of trying to get stuff done in the shortest amount of time possible. And so I wonder, if thinking and saying out loud that we just don't have enough time is enough. I don't know if it's enough. I don't think it's enough. And all we can hear in some points is that second hand moving around the face of the clock. And we know that we're beyond the 11th hour.